And we have more breaking news. In a violent attack caught on camera, a man pushing his grandchild in a stroller. When out of the blue, another man sucker punches him. It happened in Calabasas. We're just getting word of an arrest now. Our Eric Tesendis is live with that. Eric. The LA County Sheriff's Department announced about 30 minutes ago that the suspect involved in this violent attack has been arrested. He's been identified as 29 year old Angel Sanchez Jr. and he was arrested in Oxnard. And now that attack happened at that crosswalk right behind me in this Calabasas community. Now it happened Tuesday around 430. Take a look at the surveillance video. It is disturbing. Now it happened at Lost Springs Drive and Cotton Grove Trail. Surveillance footage shows when a man in a black shirt starts walking towards a grandfather who is pushing a stroller with his 11 month old grandbaby inside. Then the man sucker punches the victim and knocks him to the ground. The infant in the stroller inside of it also falls to its side. The suspect then walks away. The victim tries to get up. The suspect then jumps into a silver van and drives off. Meanwhile, the victim finally gets up and checks on his granddaughter. Neighbors say the suspect is a complete stranger to this neighborhood and that he parked in someone else's driveway. Many of the neighbors we talked to say they would always see the grandfather walking in the in the neighborhood, but they don't personally know him. They say it sounds like the like him and the baby will be okay. I'm just shocked. I just and I know, you know, you watch this stuff on the news and then you think <laughs> that everyone seems to say this. But it is when it's someone, when it's your neighbor, and it's you feel like it's a family member. It's a safe neighborhood. We've lived here for 25 years, and um, this kind of thing that's going on now is just it's really troubling. It's got us all very concerned. And investigators see the suspect, 29-year-old Angel Sanchez Jr., is from Santa. Barbara, he is connected. He's believed to be connected to another attack that happened around the same time, about half a mile where the grandfather was punched. In that incident, a teenager was attacked at a bike trail. Now back out here live, although both uh, investigators say that both victims of the assaults were of Asian descent, the motive is still under investigation. For now, reporting live in Calabasas, Eric Resendiz, ABC 7 Eyewitness News. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Get more great ABC 7 content by clicking the subscribe button for our YouTube channel and download the ABC 7 Los Angeles streaming app on Fire TV, Android TV, Apple TV, and Roku to watch on your TV.